Oh, man. Yeah, we're, we're probably gonna run it like off of the back. Oh, my goodness. You're watching Project Forward. Go to projectforward.tv and become a member today and discover the world we created to support healthy creativity. Frankie Baines. I am good. How are you? So we're here. There's two vendors. I'm here with Kevin. I forgot the HWC sheets. Kevin had them and then I took them and then I forgot them. So, but, uh, I, I'm, I'm mortified to an extent. But uh, anyway. Oh. I think so. I'm gonna go get it. But yeah, it's fun. Okay. Uh, I'm relaxed and a little high. But, uh. All right. Bam. Hey guys, Kenyo here, Holiday Writers Convention HWC 2017. Enjoying this wonderful time of year. Um, I'm going to step out of the way because I have with me an entrepreneur and a vendor, a product creator, and she's going to talk about why her product uh, is special. Yes. All right. Hi, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Asantua, and I am the owner of ARW Collection, and I make head wraps. And that's what I, if you want to say, started doing. That was my specialty. Um, and then I started to branch out from there. I made uh, different accessories from bangles to earrings, all sizes, um, necklaces. And I just want to share with you a few products that I just, um, if you want to say, created. I do everything custom, so it's handmade. Um, whatever thoughts that you have or whatever th that I put together. So there's no two pieces really mean a lot. So that's um, what's also pretty cool about it. Um, I don't know, maybe you can, you can zoom in. I don't know. Or, I'm going to do uh, some B-roll footage of them okay. afterwards to put in. So this is my new rendition um, of like the rope necklaces that I may have seen. Um, so it's, all my stuff is African inspired. Um, I love my culture and that's what I try to show in the pieces that I make. And I've got one more piece. I wanted to share with you guys. Um, so these are the coil bracelets. And I was making these already, but I did a lot of changes to them, um, which is also good to always try to make changes to make things better. Um, but this can be silver or gold, and basically you can use it for anything. You can, I like to wrap it around the arm, and it is adjustable. To your arm, so depending on you know how large or small your arm is, you can adjust it, and you can wear it up here, anywhere that it'll wrap. So I like to wear it as a choker or here, and I really like these. So, and that's it. If you all would like to get in contact with me or have something made for yourself, um, please contact me at 210-962-0131, and also on Facebook at ARW. Uh, well, excuse me, it's A.R.W. Collection. Ancestral Regal Wraps. Or Instagram also, sorry, one more. Um, and that one is a.r.w underscore collection. Thanks, peace. And then I'm I could put it on too. Yeah, you could do that. Okay. It's an interesting noise. Mm -hmm. Okay, and you can put it on. Wait, let me see. Frankie can put it on. Oh, yeah. Frankie. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. You want to put this on? You want to model real quick? I'm just getting a necklace. You're not even getting my face, are you? No. Oh. 
You make funny faces while you're doing it. Trying to get it. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. I need some more lotion. So I can go and grab my friend. I'm gonna get some focus. Oh, tell me when you're in focus. Okay, in focus. Okay. Y'all already. What's up, guys? Can you hear HWC 2017, San Antonio, uh, day two, Bitty Bomb Fest, and I have an awesome uh, entrepreneur here, creator, and student. So, whoa, okay, she's gonna come with a little bit about what makes her product, which is bracelets, really cool bracelets, which. I'm gonna get one wearing my ARW bracelet right now, but anyway, um, she's gonna say why why her product is special. It has a pretty special name, so I'm sure you have a reason why. Yes. All right. I've been coming to your aunt's office. So I'm an ecologist, and I am the creator of Wavy Bracelets, and it started off as a hobby in the summer, and it just took off, and I enjoyed doing it. Um, all my bracelets are handmade. All the packaging is handmade. And um, they do have a clever, unique uh, name to it, so Mui Mui, which is, um, yeah, it's very, very, so it's like the guys Mui Mui, and each bracelet has a, their own unique name, so this one, for example, example is Mui Mui Bonita, and yeah, everything is made, and you can find me on Instagram at Ed Mui Mui. Sí, sí, sí. 
to three eggs a day. <laughs> oh shit. Don't ask why. FB. Don't ask why. They got the bacon and it's every bush got a turkey bacon. They got all the nuts, all the treats, all the sweets. Hey, they got the stuff for my hair. Yes, it's a big item and I don't care. I guess it's HGV. HGV. They got it plenty. Gonna go again and see me. Chillin' chillin' at the HGV. Spinning dollars since I got plenty. Gonna drop a bomb. Gonna drop a bomb or something. Yes. 
Whenever you are ready. Okay, just let us know. Yeah, oh, is oh, it recording? Yeah. Oh, this what is, what is ultimate B-roll footage. Oh, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> 2017. Uh oh, all that stuff yeah. I said. Okay, let's start. Okay, start over. HWC 2017. Woo! Bini Bomb Fest. Bini Bini Bomb Bomb Fest. So, uh, yeah, Woo! Drop one of the cruise bombs for that. Woo! Oh my gosh, right. awesome collaboration, good stuff. So, yes. I'm Kenyo. Thank you, Michelle. And I'm KP. KP. I wanted to introduce you guys to this wonderful. Um, introduce you or, or just introduce her? <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Well, you want to introduce, introduce you to her, her to you, <laughs> the y'all meet. To each other. But Catherine is okay. super awesome. We're in La Mescla, which is a just opening, just becoming founded bookstore, health spot, art gallery that she's organizing. Yes, La that is La La Mescla. Mescla. So La Mescla uh, translated means the mix. Um, so That's mix of everything. So, um, you know, uh, Marco Carmona and his wife, Judy Carmona, actually run Cherry Street Co-op, which is a co-op that um, goes around and gifts bicycles to children all over, and adults as well. So they've gone to places where they're, uh, like for example in Houston, there was a flooding. They went and they gave bikes to people who have lost you know, everything. And so at a moment when you lose everything, then you have something like a gift, especially like a bike, it kind of brings that inner kid. And, uh, he mentioned that you know he had kids cry. Of course, it's like a really touching uh, gift. And so he was telling me about uh, Ch Cherry Street Co-op and its mission and La Mescla is going to be you know part of Cherry Street Co-op um, continuing you know the bike shop theme um, Botanica so they sell a uh, natural yeah you see all the bikes right here these are custom designed by Marco Carmona and I think also um, some of his buddies so they're custom and I tell them they're like works of art um, and he also sells natural products you know because Exercise is important, you know, for our physical health, but for our mental health, a lot of the times we do not take time um, to take the vitamins that we need. You know, we eat the food that we should be eating. We're in a rush. We're always uh, from here to there that we don't take care of our mental health and our physical health. And so I think it's an important and beautiful combination having both a bike and a botanica. So you're coming and you're exercising, but you're also, you can pick up, you know, um, I don't want to say pills because pills sounds like prescribed medication. Herbs. You know, herbs. herbs. Yeah, herbal supplements. Herbs sounds yeah. much better. And so while I was talking to him, I was like, well, you know, this neighborhood is in need of something like this, especially because this neighborhood is La Mescla. It's a mix of people. Yeah. You know, there is a big Latino community here, a big this is African one of the American. Most beautiful areas. Yeah, most beautiful areas and underrated. Like, yeah. I grew up in this neighborhood, so of course, spot. I'm going to brag a little bit about it. Secret like, oh, spot. The, the secret the spots here. I won't, I won't tell you all the secret spots, <laughs> but, like, I love this neighborhood. It's it's beautiful, and so I shared with Marco this idea that it's if I could just... Best spot to get a smoothie. Best spot to get a... You know what? We don't have a smoothie place around here on the east side. And so he's like, you want to incorporate that? I was like, I don't know. Yeah, there is yeah. Me yes. and get, let me and Kevin be in charge of smoothies and books in the front. Yes. Oh my gosh, yes. the deal just signed. And by the way, the books that, that we have today were donated by Bernie, <laughs> <laughs> Bernie ISD. Yeah. So they okay. donate those books. Stay I'm in contact with other um, places that are going to be donating books <laughs> for the future um, bookstore. So this is just like a little pop-up bookstore. Um, but the main goal is to have a bigger bookstore where people have a place where they have a positive environment, yeah. you know, because we were talking about this, every corner here, it's, you know, bar. Yeah. And not that there's anything wrong with bars, but like, how are you going to put bars in every corner and then blame people for not having any other outlet? Yeah. You know, they need creative outlet, especially young people that don't have that guidance yeah. and uh, really need that kind of mentoring. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, talking with Marco, um, really select, select Solidified. Solidified, yes, thank you. Holiday Writers Convention. Yeah. <laughs> that idea that it was just necessary, especially in this part of town. I see all these events, Christmas events popping up, and I never saw anything for this 
side of town, and it's like, there are children here too, there are people here too. I mean, we got snow today. <laughs> um, so I'm going to take it as a, a sign of good luck, okay? And uh, remember that Did it snow in San Antonio? It snowed in San It's going to snow in San Antonio. It's, it's, it's snow. Yes, in San Antonio. It's San Antonio. Wow. It's magic. Magic it's is coming magic. to San Antonio. <laughs> The social for everything. Yes, all the social. Where can we find you? Um, so you can find me under Instagram. Mm -hmm. um, I just changed my Instagram name. <laughs> I think it's KP underscore Gatita, which means kitty. So um, I'm going by KP now. Mm -hmm. My artist name. Woo, woo. So, KP. 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 Because Catherine, she sounds like. Catherine, is that nice? Oh, you're not nice no. No. He's coming out. No. That's how it is. <laughs> nice girls get, you know, nice girls get hurt. So KP's coming out. She's getting uh -oh. hurt. Yeah. So if you find me on Instagram. I'm, I'm, I'm afraid. <laughs> Every time I'm going to see her. Hey, she's, she's cautious back. now. Monday. She's cautious. That's good. Yeah. Who's getting Exactly. That's what it is. Thank you. I appreciate your questions. Okay. I'm smarter. Sure. More assertive. Yeah, more assertive. Yeah. Definitely. Not nice. And also, she will punch you out. in the throat. Oh, the little light yeah. Oh, 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 just. Uh, <laughs> yeah. okay. All right, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bump the clock. In your Holiday Riders Convention 2017 Kings of Leon cover. Take one. Do -do 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 uh, Canon. You can read the lyrics. He's doing karaoke.
Black a Stone, and then I'ma sing that one. Audio saying Black a Stone. She said she was gonna go too. I said she was after me.
Can we do the Holiday Riders Convention! Right. Holiday Riders Convention! Holiday Riders
us. Oh, I'm good, thank you. Because it's cold as hell. This weather, man. Oh, yeah. It has me listening to. What did you say your name was? SZA. 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 And I don't even like her. Holiday Writers Convention and it's San Antonio and it is freaking snowing. It is snowing, snowing. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Yo, what up? This is Holiday Writers Convention 2017. Woo! This is day two of four, and we're in San Antonio, Texas, and it's snowing. It's snowing hard outside. It's crazy. This is nonsense. San Antonio snowing. I never thought it would snow in San Antonio. It's been magic. here five years. It's like the coldest it's been, but it's awesome because snow is beautiful. What, 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 what have we been up to today? Today? Today feels like it's been a really long day, but this has been day two at La Mesca. It's real. She's got real snowballs. Where's the snowballs? I do call <laughs> Oh my goodness. Yo, so it is snowing. Do you see this shit? It is snowing. This is crazy. Ah. So I was told that the streets get icy. Oh yeah, you can't drive right now. Like no one can. Oh shit! <laughs> 
powder. <laughs> he threw a powder. Yo, this is the only time you will see snow in the fro. So that's what we're doing? We're throwing ice boulders? Oh, it's <laughs> Ice boulders, motherfuckers! <laughs> it is ice bouldery. It's on now. Right? Yo, it is snowing. What the chocolate chip, man? Oh, shit! Wow! Dog, that shit was fucking huge. <laughs> That's why I don't fuck with the snow like that, man. I learned by living in Maryland. Oh shit! <laughs> oh man. Yeah, we're probably gonna run it like off the bottom. Oh my goodness. I have no idea. They did that. I've only been experienced snow in Maryland. <laughs> they throw it snowball. Goodness. Yeah, they got it off the cars. Snowball! <laughs> yeah! Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Snowballs! It's snow! They're throwing snowballs! <laughs> Get a picture, get a picture. Where are you going to put snow on it? You probably even sell those pictures for me. Right? Oh, you got snow in your hair. <laughs>